how on earth can we start to get past that fear and loathing of the whole self-promotion process? I know some people just really have a hard time with it. Yeah, I, I talk to my clients about this constantly. I think this is a, a regular story for all of us that, that sense that people should just see the good work that I do. They should really recognize and push me forward because I'm doing good things. But the world isn't fair. The world doesn't work like that, you know? So, and yet we also look at, these people who are self-aggrandizing and oh I'm so fabulous all the time and we think ooh that's icky I don't want to be that but I often tell people that you know those people are a 10 on a scale of 1 to 10 they're fortunately fewer and far between but we see them they're very visible and we think oh I don't want to be that but most of us are like a 1 or a 2 you know I always want you with the 5 or 6 so what I really want to think about is if you are speaking about something you care about, if you are moving forward a change in your company, in your, in your community, doesn't that matter more than whether or not you are too big for your britches or whatever the story is you're telling yourself about, oh, I shouldn't be self-promoting because it's bad or wrong. Instead, I could say focus on the cause, focus on the change. And, and I talk a lot in the book about the what if future. For me, what if women had 50% of the venture capital funding in the United States? That was my what if future. It was very motivating. And by the way, it's been a lot of years since I started working in this industry and we're still at maybe 8%. Really? So, really? yeah. Oh yeah, the highest I think we've ever been is maybe 10. So we have a enormous path ahead. You know, we've got a long way to 50 and that is what keeps me going. Instead of worrying about whether I'm too loud or too uppity or whatever, it's like, who else is gonna move that effort forward if I don't move it myself and if I don't get others to join me? So I, I try to get people to be outside themselves and let go of that. And then I love Guy Kawasaki. He, he talks a lot about how, you know, if you if you done it, it ain't bragging. You know, this is the truth. If you have, are adding value, then get out there and add value and don't worry about those naysayers and those people who are, are judging you.